Good morning. I am so happy and excited right now. We just turned on our bridge cam and I can see St. Lucia. It looks beautiful. I can't wait. I'm so happy that we made it. <laughs> <laughs> There's all kinds of rumors going around on the ship last night that we weren't going to go to Dominique and we'd have another, or I mean St. Lucia, and we'd have another canceled port. And I said, oh, please, no. But anyways, we're here. We're still docking, but it looks like it's going to happen this time. However, we almost docked yesterday and we had to leave. Don't say that. <laughs> no negativity allowed. The, we, uh, we'll show you what we see here on the webcam and, uh, the, sorry, the bridge cam. And it is kind of an interesting little port here because it's tucked in so tight and I guess I was concerned but because it's so tight it's very protected. I barely see a wave at all in the little harbor here so that's a good sign. It is a good sign. So we're going to go in, we're going to go outside, maybe show you a little bit more of this uh, cute little port and get this day started because we have to be downstairs on the pier at 820 mm -hmm. to meet a whole bunch of our other uh, guests that are traveling with us yeah a whole whole group of the people on our group cruise has booked the same excursion as we have and we're going to be on a catamaran seeing the pittens today so i'm so excited let's go let's do it we are playing journey of the secret word once again in this video you're looking for one of 10 letters for this vlog series we are excited to announce that level eight will be rewarding the winner with a piece of luggage good luck everybody off we go to take a look off the side of the ship. It tried raining a second ago and then there was rainbows and sunshine so sounds like the Caribbean. Okay here we are in St. Lucia. First outside views and got some... we've got a Oceana. I can't quite read the back of that boat. It starts with an S the name. Yeah, of San Sonona? S Sierra? Siena? I don't know I can't see. Yes. Some scary looking clouds, but you can see the sun's out. The deck is deck is wet. wet it as is the railing rain. here. We get some bow thruster action happening first thing this morning. So let's go look out the other side of the boat, and then maybe we'll grab a quick nibble at the International Cafe before leaving the ship. Oh, you're here just as they're tying there up the go. line. Other side of the ship. Oh, the lines are coming ashore. Live docking action. Oh, there's another ship over there. Yeah, he's waving to us. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like some kind of a monarch symbol on the stack of that ship beside us. I'm not sure what it is though. Oh yeah. Looks yeah. like it's permanently parked there from what I can tell. Yeah. Docked there. There's the little village area at St. Lucia. And the sky is trying to clear. It's like a Here's what I found for breakfast. Those burritos are really good in the cinnamon roll. We are here now, getting off in St. Lucia. There we go. And first views. We are walking to our excursion now. We are. There are 34 of us, all from the group, that are joining for our catamaran ride. It was raining for a second, but it stopped now. It looks like it's gonna be sunny. Hello, we are on the catamaran. We are getting ready to go. It's a beautiful, hot, sunny day here right now. Next stop, the ocean. Here we go. <laughs>
also for those of you going swimming, you guys want to get a bit of ground swim. So those of you going swimming, you got to dive out. Ground swim, so please be careful. Yeah. Hey, we're in the water. Beautiful St. Lucia. Saving people? Yeah. yeah. Cruise yeah. director of lifeguard. He's really, he was really nervous, so I thought I'd be there to help him. I just got wiped out by a wave. Yeah. My hat was gone, I thought I lost everything. Oh no! Yeah, I had to go find my hat in the water. <laughs> I found I found it all. <laughs> yeah, you don't want to go too short, close to shore. It's counterintuitive. You think that's safer? But I, had, I had a couple of waves knock me on my ass, lost my hat, lost everything. <laughs> We're swimming in the rain. Swimming in the rain. It's raining. Yeah. It's raining. Yeah. It's raining. It's raining. There's the clouds. I think I'm going to go. Oh, big old man. Oh, big old man. Oh. 
no se me olvida Ni tus besos y tus chistes al azar Quiero ser tu amor, tu amor en tu vida Contigo yo me siento en control Quiero ser tu amor, tu amor en tu vida Did you have fun in your catamaran? Oh my gosh. It was the best excursion. I probably had at least 10 people come say it was the most fun they've ever had on excursion. We just had a blast. It was so much fun, guys. Yeah. It was wonderful. Getting 34 of our group on that ship, and it was a party the whole time. It was so much fun. It's yeah. hard to believe the day has just begun. <laughs> we still have Super Bowl tonight and an afternoon on the ship. Ooh, this, this vlog might have to be in a two-series uh, vlog. <sighs> okay, time to get on the ship, get some AC, and yeah. a cold drink, and some lunch. Yeah. Back we go. Okay. Sir, please no digital screening. Please. Yep. Back on the ship we go. Whew, we made it. Barely up the stairs. Off we go. We clean up good after going to the beach. Well, I sort of have the <laughs> hair don't care going on right now, but at least it's washed and there's no more salt in it. I decided to go back to the Cruising Canucks group cruise t-shirt to have some lunch. We have headed up to the World Fresh Marketplace, also known as the Buffet. Here we go, Let's see what there is. A little bit of chicken today, some sandwiches. I saw some meatballs back there, but there's no chicken nuggets today. Mm -hmm. Okay, I was just walking through the buffet and I was saying to the camera that I didn't see any chicken nuggets and the chef with the big white hat came out and he says, would you like chicken nuggets, sir? I'll go back and make them for you right now. So, Mrs. Kanak would kill me if that happens. <laughs> so it's bad enough the meatloaf, so. But he did say they're gonna be available tonight for the game, so I'll have them then. Okay, here's my first selection for lunch. I thought I had a little bit of salad. I recreated something that I had in the Mediterranean on the Enchanted Princess, which is Caesar salad topped with meatballs as the meat. My lunch is done, but Mrs. Kanaka's is back with her lunch. Mm-hmm. I went with my favorite thing at the Salty Dog, the chicken fingers and some fries. Would you like chicken nuggets? I have a sauce. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, yeah. Mm. <laughs> no. Spoiled? Spoiled? Spoiled much, Mr. Kanuk? Yeah. There you go. Your eyes did not deceive you. Those are chicken nuggets. For the first time I've got them on the cruise, some barbecue sauce. I went up for chicken fingers and out came the nuggets, so I was very happy. Me the chef did it after I talked to him. Yeah, I don't know how much we've talked to you. Briefly this morning, briefly throughout the day. I'm sure you saw the fun. Um, many people said best excursion they've ever done in our group. We had a blast. We might have left a deposit or two in the ocean there because a whole group of us, I think there was myself and three other group cruisers, but sunglasses flew off our heads as a wave took us under. But fabulous day. Yeah, fun day. Mm -hmm. Hopefully you saw the fun footage. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah, we booked that excursion through the cruise line. We did. And uh, we were on there with, I don't know, I bet our group of 30 some odd people was about half of the people that were on there. So mm -hmm. it must have been probably about 70 people. Yeah. It wasn't too bad. We just laid out at the front part of the catamaran or we're dancing. I never felt like I was like tight for people. No. Yep. So good times were had. Very Came back. Time, yeah. A little bit of a suntan. Mm -hmm. If you can tell. Mm -hmm. We're a little sun kissed tonight. <laughs> See that? So, so tonight is Super Bowl. It is. There is a San Francisco team playing a Kansas City team. Mm -hmm. They won't let Canadian teams into the NFL. <laughs> Just saying. It's a totally different so, thing, isn't it? So we have the no <laughs> CL football if you don't know about that, the Canadian Football League. Mm -hmm. So we are going to go and have a little bit of a cocktail. There's some different things going on because of the game being played in several venues. There's still some other ship stuff going on. So you're probably going to see a mix of everything tonight. Yeah, we're not quite sure how, how it'll all play out, but we're going to sort of hop into a few different things and see what we can get up to. Yep, so let's get this Super Bowl night started. I'm not okay. sure who you're cheering for. By the time you watch this vlog, it'll be all over. Ooh, who are you cheering for? I am cheering for the Miami Dolphins. <laughs> Because by the time this vlog comes out, they'll be rebuilding to win next year. Okay. <laughs> Let's go. Let's do it. Tonight's Super Bowl dress is blue and white with vertical stripes, little, little embroidery, little flowery things on the sleeves. And the length looks like it's about one quarter length with white sandals. 
white clutch purse and straight hair. We came this way tonight so we can see the candy girl. She's got a whole bunch of new admirers though on this cruise. She sure does. Our Platinum Elite and Sweet guests. Sweet. In we go. Okay, we came down to, for the Vista appetizers and look what I found tonight. If you see through the glare, we've got chicken nuggets. They're huge, much bigger than the ones I found at lunch today. And some of those. Grabbed a couple nibbles here at the Vista Lounge. I grabbed some chicken nuggets to share. And... Hi. Oh, you got chicken nuggets to I share too. I tried one chicken nugget. I'm not <laughs> sharing it. A little bit of nachos and salsa and some fruit and cheese here. And they've run out of Crown Royal. In fact, they've run out of all Canadian whiskey. So I'm on to Woodford and diet. Mm. The group we're having dinner with tonight, to my left is Stacy, Avar, Kevin, Gail, Rob, Bonnie, Susan, and Ted. And of course, Mr. Canuck. Let's not leave him out. Okay. We all know he loves meatballs. And that Menu tonight, chef's dinner. Meatloaf is not starters. But he has done like a 14-day cruise just a vegetarian. Hmm. What to have? Okay, I thought I'd try the Caesar salad tonight for my first appetizer. Funny, so funny. What do you have? I am actually trying a new new uh, appetizer that I haven't even seen on the menu before with Princess, but it's called Vol Event, and it has it is full of seafood, so it's got my interest. A little bit of lobster in there and a few other things. Just what everyone else at the table ordered it as well. Yeah, the majority <laughs> did. <laughs> oh. Second appetizer arrived is the vegetable terrine. It's like layers of pepper and artichokes and all kinds of vegetables with a little of asparagus. Some salad. No, he said something one eat. Dinner has arrived. I'm having the spaghetti a la carbonara. Mm. I am having the beef wellington tonight. I'm having Parmesan now. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Our waiter brought us some extra little treats before dessert was delivered tonight. Dessert has arrived. I'm having the sugar-free coconut cake. And I am having ice contro souffle. Ice contro souffle. There you go. Thank you, Stacy. <laughs> Spell it. Nope. Sorry, <laughs> guys. Back to the room after dinner. Got to drop off something special. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Gail and Kevin, of course. Everybody's spoiling Jerry. More of the gummy wine comes. There you go. <laughs> see. We're here at the Vista Lounge. They are having way, football John. tonight in here. Run. Tonight is Super Bowl. We got snacks. A room full of people. And of course, you got the game on up top. Okay, we're out at the main pool now. Super Bowl is going on out here too, and it is packed. Look at everybody. We got a big ice sculpture. Super Bowl. There you go. Under the stars, Super Bowl. Okay, we left the Super Bowl so we can come down and catch the comedian that's in the main theater. It's not super busy in here because a lot of people are watching the game. We thought we'd catch this and head back up and hopefully we'll catch halftime in the second half of the game. Score is still tied, I think, after almost one quarter. Anyways, time for some bounty. Not, not sure who it even is, if it's a new comedian or not, but we're going to go back to the game after this and hopefully we'll find some snacks. I saw chicken nuggets in the buffet. So. Please, a huge round of applause and welcome to the stage, your comedian, Troy Thurgill! So I've actually beat out the Super Bowl for 35 minutes. Thank you for coming out, Canadians. <laughs> Americans are watching the game. I knew you were from Canada. <laughs> okay, we're back here to grab halftime at the Vista Bar. I just noticed that there are pogos here. This is one thing I've never seen on a cruise ship. One of my favorite things. I'm about to have a pogo for the first time ever on a cruise. Okay, your eyes do not deceive you. I am eating a pogo on a cruise ship. Crazy, right guys? I'm choosing to do this over watching Usher on the halftime show. Oh, but come on. <laughs> Usher at the halftime show. 
Okay, we're back up on the Lido deck. Catching the second half of the game. San Fran is winning by a touchdown right now. Oh, there's a sad James ahead. <laughs> Got a <laughs> Back to the cabins we go. Well, that was a day. That was a day. My goodness. The highs and lows. Yep, for sure. <laughs> for some people. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We had no skin in the game. Mm -hmm. There was no Canadian team playing. Mm -hmm. The Super Bowl. No. But we were with some San Francisco fans that weren't happy at the ending. Yeah, I think like the majority of our group were San Francisco fans. Yeah. Yep. So, yep. There you go. It was the end of a crazy day that started out with some catamaraning. It was a wonderful day. Gosh, we had so much fun on the catamaran and with everybody and, you know, enjoyed the beautiful sunshine, the ocean, all of that. Managed to find my first ever pogo at sea. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's see if any other cruise line can match that. Oh, man. <laughs> Be on the hunt for another pogo somewhere in another fleet. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Or have to come back and find now I know they have them on the ship. Mm -hmm. For Super Bowl parties only. Probably a Sparrow Moon special for that. Mm -hmm. We'll see. <laughs> Hope I don't have 20 more years of cruising without a pogo. That's all I gotta say because you're gonna get so sick of that word. Oh no. <laughs> also found chicken nuggets today. Like what a successful day when it comes to the menu. Yes. I have no words. <laughs> so that's the story. Tomorrow? We are at a new port. We are. New port for us. We've never been there before, so we have everything crossed that that happens and that we get to explore a new island for us. Yep. Martinique is what we wake up to, we hope, tomorrow. Mm-hmm. But for now, we're going to get to sleep. It's late because of overtime in the football game. Uh-huh. See? <laughs> there you go. My hair's all frizzed from all the humidity. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, see you in the morning. Have a good night's sleep. We'll wake up another tropical paradise, you hope. Yes. <laughs> Good night, everybody. Good night.